Good morning, holy comforters. Just a quick word to remind you that tomorrow, Sunday, September 19th, the first service of the day is at 8 a.m. 8 a.m. And then following that service, those who want to will decamp to snow camp to Joe and Tish Murray's house and farm to enjoy a day of worship, festivities, frolic, fun, and food. Be a catered fried chicken lunch available to you there, as long as well as a pond for uh, boating, a pond for being tossed into. I suspect the rector may find himself wet by the end of the day. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> so come on out. 10.30 service on the porch, and then picnic, party, and fun. Look forward to seeing you there. Other uh, issues is the organist choir master search is on full speed. The search committee has done great work and has already secured two interviews with uh, very, very worthwhile candidates. We look forward to their report very soon. If you have gotten an invitation to uh, put in your two cents worth about what you want in an organist choir master, give them a nickel. Make sure your voice is heard. And then, uh, well, there's not a lot other things going on except that there's everything going on. There's Christian formation, there's uh, property projects afoot do respond to those property op project opportunities, either cleaning or um, fixing or talking about what we want to do going forward. I'm happy to uh, hear any more thoughts about uh, time of services time and day of Christian formation classes um, and uh, other needs you see around the church that we should attend to. Um, I want to thank all those that are contributing as members of the staff and those that are assisting the staff in their work. There's a lot of people doing a lot of work to make this a house of prayer that has an effect on our lives and the lives of those of our community. Speaking of which, we still think we're going to go ahead with the uh, community lunch the first Saturday of each month. And then directly following the first Saturday of October is the second, October 3rd, mark this down, October 3rd, following the Sunday worship, we'll have a stewardship kickoff meeting. We'll have a stewardship kickoff luncheon. It'll be safe. It'll be socially distanced. It'll be uh, done in all the ways that will keep us from uh, infecting anyone else who might be with us or to catch anything from anyone else who might be with us, as we have been doing every Sunday. So let me close with this last word. We've all got to wear masks all the time, whether we're vaccinated or not, especially for the care of those who are not vaccinated, those children we want to come to church, those 12-year-olds, and younger, who we want in our midst, can't come if we don't wear our masks. So let's all wear our masks all the time, every day that we gather for worship. Okay? It's just the easiest, safest, best practice. All right. Hey, I'll see you tomorrow, 8 o'clock, or later at 10.30. And if you go to the early service, there's no reason not to come out later for the party, the picnic, the festivities, and fun. And most of all, the fellowship. God bless you. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.